Hello guys, it is your girl Mirandi and I am back with another video and I have another message here for you guys and so um told you guys I was resting but this is something that the Lord has continuously placed on my heart to speak about and I believe now is the time I was gonna do it a couple days ago but um yeah, that wasn't that wasn't the time. So now is the time. And so God has been speaking to me a lot about um someone getting ready to have a child. And before I like go into that a little bit more, um I also want to talk about women who have decided to get fixed so that way they essentially are not able to have kids or don't have kids any longer. And so any of you who has read my book or knows my testimony, you know that, you know, my pregnancy was, uh, it was a journey. And after I had my daughter, I chose and I decided to get a device put in my arm called the Next Plan, which essentially allowed me to not have kids. And so... Um, just as I was going through my healing journey with Heavenly Father and healing and just, you know, on this journey with him, he had me take it out. And so I actually took it out last year. And I'm just like, there's no really need for me to have it anyway because I'm not sexually active and I'm not doing anything. And I haven't been in quite some time. So there was really no need for me to have it. So I was just like, okay, whatever, like I'll take it out. And plus it was causing me issues in my ovaries. Um, I began to get cysts growing in my ovaries. And so I chose to also you know, get rid of it so that way I can see how my body would like fully function with me not having it in my body. And so I chose to get it, you know, removed and just be obedient to Heavenly Father. But, you know, it's important to know that children are a blessing from God and the fruit of the womb is a blessing. And so I know for me, I chose to be fixed well a sense of fixation if that's a word um to basically be able to not have children because of a traumatic experience and just things that I went through and I know actually so many women or even people that I know who also have chosen to do the same thing and I believe that it is an attack from the enemy to get women to close their womb so that way they don't have children and I would say 99.9% .9 of the women that I know that have chosen to either get fixed to get their tubes tied to get a neck plan or whatever it is it was because of a traumatic life event that happened into their life or in their life and so I just really 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 would recommend you know seeking god before making that decision if you haven't made that decision already and or if you already have and there's a way for you to be able to reverse it that you also seek the lord and seek you know guidance on what he wants you to do regarding you know if you're able to reverse it because i believe that again children are a blessing the fruit of the womb is a blessing to be able to birth children is a blessing and um, I told you guys he has been speaking to me a lot about someone getting ready to birth and have a child and I'm like God I don't know why you keep telling me this because it ain't me it ain't me because first of all I'm not married second of all my phone is drier than the Arizona desert. So <laughs> I know it's not me. I'm like, oh, maybe it's my sister. Like, maybe it's my sister. I always wanted to be an auntie anyway. Um, but she wasn't having it. She was like, don't, don't put that mess on her. She ain't about to have no kids, which I mean, she's young. I get it. Um, but she's getting older. She's getting older. And so ultimately, 
God is getting ready to do a new thing. And maybe it's some of you guys here as well that are planning to have a child, want a child, or, you know, maybe you've been working on it. And so I believe that you are getting ready to birth a baby here very soon and he's continuously showed me that and he said he also said birthing a child in wedlock in wedlock which means you will be married when you have your child you will have godly offspring godly children and so whoever that is for whether it's the reversal or whether it's the new birth and the babies and the children being birthed, like whatever part of it is for you, God is doing a new thing and he just wants you to know that children, children are a blessing. The fruit of the womb is a blessing. The ability to birth a child is a blessing and such a beautiful thing. And, you know, get ready for or congratulations for the new birth or baby or babies godly offspring that's getting ready to happen within your womb because we know that when god is doing a new thing and when he's setting up his kingdom often that has to come through some new birth some babies being birthed like before jesus could come what happened he had to be birthed through mary before moses could come and rescue the israelites from Egypt what happened a baby had to be birth which was Moses and so there's so many significant stories throughout the Bible even Solomon being birth which was for what the rebuilding of the temple like so many things that are happening and getting ready to happen are of the cause of the woman birthing and carrying the child and so it it has to happen it needs to happen in order for god's will and plans to happen and so we just got to make sure that we're in alignment and we're being obedient through the father to be able to experience these amazing beautiful wonderful things that are happening and going on and so again i don't know who needed to hear this message but I pray this message blesses you. I love you guys. Be blessed. And I will be back with another video. Elohim willing. Bye, guys.